Hello everyone, this is a demonstration on the current project, which is the David Hockney inspired photo montage project. And as you can see, I've got sketchbook open and move this over here. I've got quite a few pictures on the stage here, whoops. And I'll show you just how many I have here. I've got probably I want to say close to 15 pictures um, that I've got. And once you've got them imported, and again, just to refresh you on that, if you click up here on the little mountain range sign here with the plus sign, that is going to get you access to your photos. And that's how you import your pictures. I have not been able to figure out a way to get more than one picture at a time in there. So it took me about five minutes to get all the pictures in there. But once you have them in there, the next step is to try to make some sense of what it is you have. And what I've been doing, as you can see down here on the bottom left, I've got these images that um, I've made smaller just so I can see all the pictures at once. And then I can decide where they should go. Um, so what I'm going to continue to do is, um, click on the larger pictures and then make them smaller. So the way that you do that is you select the picture with your finger or your stylus, and then you have to go up to this button right here. This is going to allow you to transform it. Um, don't click any of these buttons though, um, unless you want to physically change in terms of the, um, the proportions, uh, well, we do want to change the proportions, but this is going to skew your picture. This is going to rotate. This is going to flip either uh, horizontally or vertically. This is going to nudge, which um, is handy if you want to move it just a couple of pixels. But um, we just need to, I'm going to, I'm going to restart this. We just need to first select. And now I'm just using my um, thumb and my index finger. Oops, I got the wrong one selected. Okay, that one's good. You just use your thumb and your, your index finger to, um, to make those smaller or larger. So I'm going to hit done on that one and go to another picture. Okay, let's see, is that one? Yeah, that's a good one. All right, so I need to make that one smaller. I do the same thing. I go up to this transform, click on that, use my thumb, and my index finger to make it smaller. And I'm just gonna kind of hang them, have them hang out down here uh, until I get them all this size. And then I can see what it is that I have to work with. And then I'm going to start going in there and cropping out some information I don't need. So I have done, I go down here, oops. And click up there, make that smaller. And that is it for, well, I'm gonna keep going um, eventually, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop the video and um, the next video I'm gonna show you is, um, is gonna have all these guys um, completely transformed down to about this size. So um, that is gonna be for part two.